day two of this horrible sunburn. Anyways, I'm still recovering from it. I think this is what I'm going to be talking about all week. How horrible. Anyways, I know my face looks kind of weird, but I did put this mask on that I bought at Target a few weeks ago or like a month or two ago, and I never used them. And now I'm using them. <laughs> so uh, the one I'm the one I have on is an aloe vera one, which is to hydrate and nourish. So hopefully it helps me because as you can see, my forehead is still burnt, the side of my face. I just put chapstick on because my lips are feeling hell of dry. I'm trying to drink as much as water I can to see if it also helps. There we go. Um, so yeah, that's what I have on my face this morning. It is about to be 10 a.m. We got up a few hours ago, but I just didn't grab the camera. My body still hurts. I have a toddler that just wants to be climbing on me, and my hands, you know, they're burnt, as you can see. They hurt. <laughs> my legs hurt, and she just wants to be climbing on me, so she rubs on my skin, and I can't explain the feeling. If it's not one thing, it's another. So, I just hope this sunburn goes away, this feeling of a sunburn goes away soon. Because I do not like feeling uncomfortable. Or, you know, I'm already pregnant. It's like, what's the worst that could happen? So before I go downstairs, I am going to start on my bed. So yeah, let me go ahead and finish that before I go downstairs. So that I at least I can know in my mind that, hey... You already did the bed. <laughs> I'm going to go downstairs and do some breakfast for me and the kids. And yeah, I think I have just one more load to wash. And then I need to put a bunch of clothes away. Um, because I do not want it to stay in the basket. Because once it stays in the basket, forget about it. It's there for like a whole week. Alright, so I have Jaylene's um, outfit right here. While my mask on my face dries, I'm going to go ahead and comb her hair. Dress her up for the day. Nothing special. We're not going anywhere. Probably just pick up a Target drive-up order. So, yeah, I'm just going to do her ponytail so that I could get her hair out of the way off of her face. That is how she's looking right now. Ratchet Jaylene. <laughs> hey, Jaylene is ready to start her day. Let's go. That bow that she has on is so cute, and it's just a dollar at the Dollar Tree. So, if you're looking for bows for your daughter, check out Dollar Tree. It's so cute. So I just texted my husband and I asked him, do you want enchiladas de pollo, tacos, the carne molida, which is um, ground beef tacos, or do you want spaghetti? And he said spaghetti. I was going to go all out and do the enchiladas, like chicken enchiladas, but he wants spaghetti. So, And then when I make spaghetti, what all of us eat, all the kids, they're not being picky or anything like that. I'm here in the freezer. I have a bunch of crap. My kids bought these ice creams the other day at Costco. I let them have like maybe one a week, but no more. Because these are huge. They're the big ones. Well, they're, they're not huge, but you know, there's the mini ones and then there's this ones. And it's a, like a whole ice cream cone. So, I showed you girls my chocolates yesterday. I'm looking for the ground beef. So, I could put it to on freeze. The good thing is that the ground beef usually, it unfreezes like super quick. I'm going to do this one. Because usually my husband doesn't like a lot of meat on it. And then I have salad like yesterday. I bought the salad from Costco. So I have my spaghetti sauce there. And just like last time I bought the salad again, it's super good. So we'll eat salad with some spaghetti. Okay, so I haven't opened up my curtains because it is so hot outside. And it's it's so hot outside and it's going to be so hot the next few days. It's going to be like in the 100s. I'm actually editing a video right now. When I first showed you my sunburn, it was bad. <laughs> I guess it calmed down a little bit. But my forehead and my nose were so red in that video. If you haven't seen it, it's the vlog before this one. Don't you guys just not like having things open? Like, I don't know. I don't know if it's just me. Do you want to say hi? Say hi! She is eating an ice cream. These are mini mango, pineapple, chamoy, tajin. She loves them. You go, girl. 
and she's watching her Alexa. Let me have some. Can I have some? It's so good. No, it's okay, Mama. You eat it. Mmm, she wants to give you girl some. So, yeah. Go, Jaylene. Go. And she... Her hair is always just messing up. It took Kate, though. I'm lagging it, and I should be making my target order. Am I the only one that spies outside <laughs> through the peak hole? I'm always looking outside. Make sure you guys are cleaning up upstairs. Make sure that you guys are cleaning up upstairs. Yeah, act like you can't hear me. He said he couldn't hear me. So we're here, we drove to Redlands to bring our vehicle, our truck. I am in my uh, father-in-law's truck, <laughs> Jaden. Jason and Jaylene is behind me. So my husband was driving our Silverado and we came to drop it off. Uh, I really don't like to mention like a lot of that happens like this, but he did get rear-ended I'm not sure how big the other vehicle was big rig. I don't know. I didn't really ask him but um, Obviously that driver was like trying to not get in trouble. So he didn't want to pay cash Pay us cash to get our truck fixed, but I told him you know what? I don't I don't I don't feel comfortable with that plan what if he gives you fake money? What if you never hear from him again and stuff? So I told him, you know what, just go through his insurance. However that works, go through the insurance. Like it's just better. And you don't have to be like fighting and discussing with people like, oh, you know, I need more money to fix my vehicle. So I'm still not sure what they're gonna do to it. I didn't even take pictures of it or nothing, but he did get rear-ended and uh, yeah so we're gonna get that fixed right away because it is a vehicle that we use and we need um <laughs> you're sort of hilarious you guys need to stop that's what it is to have kids i tell my little sisters don't have kids so young i hope they listen to me i had my kids when i was like 20 21 my boys and then jaylene like at 27 or was i 26 hey turn off the flashlight anyways so we're here waiting for my husband. I am not driving back. <laughs> he took us through this um, canyon where it goes from um, the city we live in to this city here. And it's crazy, so many curves. And then so many cars going fast, it's just crazy. I finished editing my video and I reviewed it and I'm uploading it. So that's gonna take a while. It's like about 16 minutes long. We are back. We dropped off the truck and then picked up our other vehicle, the, the Mustang. So anyways, I already made food. I came right home, made food. And then there's that McDonald's evidence back there. <laughs> I door dashed the kids some fries and nuggets because they were craving fries and nuggets. And I just didn't want to be that mean mom. Like, no, we're not going to get some. You know, they, they were acting pretty good, you know, going and bringing the vehicle. So I was like, what the heck? So I make some spaghetti and I have my salad right here. I've learned that with the iPhone 11, the front camera, if there's no good quality, like it's gonna be recording really, really, really bad. Like it's gonna look kind of like cartoonish. But anyways, I'm barely opening up the windows. I did turn on the air already because it did feel hot when we got back. So yeah, let me serve myself some food. I'm hungry. So here is my plate and just waiting on my husband, but I'm gonna go ahead and start eating. This is one of the other purchases I made at Costco. I did went back for those brooms. I seen these brooms last time and I was like, hey, I'm gonna pick them up. It's actually two of them. One is for inside the house and one is for outside. And it comes with um, one of these little things to pick up the trash. So I like the color because I usually have this green one 
and it's kind of like just like an awkward color out there it's still good but I think I'm gonna use this green one uh, to clean up outside and then just save the other one so yeah and it was two for $8.99 the other one I have it over here but I am gonna be saving it uh, for another time or like for when I need it you know what I mean you know what I mean it looks like we're having a witch party right here hey everyone and welcome once again today is like the third vlog with my sunburn anyways we just came to pick up that drive up I had I was supposed to pick it up yesterday but the uh, things how things went I wasn't really feeling on coming and picking it up and then this morning I was so scared I had one diaper right I for sure had one diaper but then Jaylene decided to you know do number two so TMI so then I was like holy smokes I have no diapers like no diapers I have the water water what's it called like like the pool diapers like to put them in the pool but I didn't have any more of her water pampers diapers? but guess what I went in her closet usually where I put her diapers and I see like I guess two of them were hiding behind her little basket and luckily I found two diapers hide those papers dude <laughs> so anyways I have my kids with me Jaden is there Jaylene Jason Jaylene is like all coloring herself we're gonna go get a slurpee what kind of slurpee do you want Jason you want Skittles Mountain Dew or what is the other one they have what do you want to tell me if you don't subscribe Piggy will steal your brain and Piggy will steal your brain. Yeah. <laughs> it's Piggy from Roblox. And I'm not making this stuff up. He ain't making that stuff up. No, he ain't. Anyways, today is the third day when my sunburn. It was Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and today's Wednesday. It's kind of feeling a little better. I took a shower earlier and it then it started to sting a little bit. So that sucks. It's 95 degrees outside today. I'm wearing a long sleeve. Want to know why? Because I feel so uncomfortable and I feel so ugly and hideous with the sunburn in my arms. Like it feels, it feels and it looks horrible. Um, so that's why I have a long sleeve so I won't keep seeing it and then reminding me myself. And besides that, I was already starting to feel like a little ugly <laughs> with this pregnancy because, you know, I don't usually do my makeup. It's one starting to get 100 degrees outside. Like, I'm not going to be melting with makeup on. And, um, like I tell you guys, I was just feeling hideous. I was starting to feel hideous. And now with this, with the sunburn, it's like I feel even worse. <laughs> Things could be worse, though. Um, so let's go. Let's go to Taco Bell. We're gonna get the kids a Slurpee, like I told you guys. Or they're called freezes. Freezes right here at Taco Bell. They're actually a dollar. They're a dollar when it's happy hour. So go to your nearest Taco Bell. We'll call them first to see if they still do that for your local Taco Bell. But let's go get one. All right, we order our freezes, our freezes, whatever they're called, and we're waiting to get them. We're next, we're next. Yeah. SI, SI. What was she? My kids are driving me crazy. <laughs> Wait, which way does the telescope go? Once the baby is here, like, we're not gonna be able to fit in this car. No way. <laughs> It's going to be like a date car or like a, I'm just going to go to the grocery real quick or I'm just going to go to Target real quick. A quick run. Or this is going to be your guys' car. Hopefully this lasts until the kids are 17, 18. We want to keep it for them. So we just got back. These are what the freezes, freezes look like. They're a dollar. They're a pretty good size like for kids. Um, I also got myself a quesadilla and a Mountain Dew Blast. The strawberry, the the red one usually is Skittles, but this one is strawberry or wild strawberry. And this one is Mountain Dew Blast, like a Slurpee style. Aiden is hungry. They thick boy. <laughs> Let me open up the blinds. But he's hungry, you don't have to do that. <laughs> Let's 
Yeah. Are you gonna want like four? Oh yeah, like four. Four. So he's hungry. So he cracked the eggs. He put them in a bowl. He mixed them. Um, I, <laughs> do the dance I, again. I <laughs> so he I mixed made, them. And I he... left one of the eggshells in there. Yeah. Yeah. Did you in there? Yeah. Well, that's gonna be crunchy. <laughs> So I'm just gonna help him um, cook because he can't turn it around by himself, but he wants some tortillas. I can, I can if I try. I honestly let my kids like cook because I'm already seven. You're only seven. You're gonna be eight soon. He Baby kicked... bump looking really big today. We are 32 weeks already. Whoa. Thank you. I feel like I'm having twins. It's twins. Tell them. So whenever um, I go to my grandma's house, sometimes and there's parties. Sometimes my grandma buys these big ass freaking what's it called? Watermelons. Watermelons. But I think they're not seedless. So I think those are not oh. seedless. Oh yeah. I was gonna start recording in Spanish, and then I'm like, nope. I'm supposed to be recording in English. But anyways, my nose is starting to peel a little bit. I'm just going to leave it alone. But my face, it hurts. I'm going to be a little bit productive here. I have some clothes to put away, as you guys have seen in the basket behind me. These are size 5. She is between a 5.5 and, and then a 6. It's a little bit too big still. So this one's right here. I've been having them since the boys were little. They all basically used them. And we're going to save them for the next baby because they leave them literally, they leave them literally like new. So I'm just going to have to clean them up a little bit, but they always leave them new. This one's two. This one's are a size, um, size five. And like I told you, Jaylene, is like a five and a half size six. So this one's, we are going to leave them for the baby boy. And Jaylene did use these a few times, a few times. These were so cute. They These were handy downs, um, but they did fit her a few times. These are size four. So these ones definitely don't fit her. They're, they've just been stored in here. This ones are size five. These are so cute. Cat and Jack, she did use them a few times. Scraped them a little bit. I'm going to see if they still fit. It depends. But they probably don't. Because she has some other ones and they barely fit and they're flats. Uh, this one's my mom got them for her in Mexico. They do fit. The only thing that it's a little bit hard for her to wear them. Because this just like moves around too much. And then and there's a fry in here. But it's from her little kitchen. And then this one is a size 5. Uh, the other one is I think it's in the pañalera. The other one is in my diaper bag, so I have to get it out and see if they still fit her. They should. They're sandals. Sandals usually fit longer. These ones are too hard to put on her feet. So I might have to save them. For the baby. I think they're like a size five and a half. Uh, these are the ones that I got for her a really long time ago when we found out it was a girl. I had bought her this ones right here because they were on clearance. And I had bought her these right here to announce the gender. And these are, I believe, are size 6.5. These are size 7. So these are almost going to fit her. Almost. <laughs> I think by the end of the year. And then these ones are from the boys. They did leave them, like, brand new. I will always buy my boy shoes, 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 running shoes. These are size 11c but i'm saving them for j let me know if you're the same like you just save shoes that the kids leave and then this ones are size what are they i believe size 10 so these are really nice and see they leave them like brand new literally i do have an unboxing of this bed of Jaylin. So if you guys want to see that in my channel, I do have an unboxing and it's so convenient because it has this down here so you can store shoes, clothes, socks, diapers, anything you want to store. Um just as long as you don't overpack it. And then this one's she did leave them. 
so I'm going to be saving them for the baby. And then this ones, I just bought them a size way too big. I thought they were going to be perfect, but I was so easy to go back to Target and change the size. So I got stuck with a 7, but I am definitely going to go back and see if they have a 6. Just because they didn't have a 6. That's why I got 7 and I was like, I'll just keep them. 7, this ones are a size 5. But I don't think they fit her anymore. I'm going to have to try them on her. That's how I store her shoes. And then some of them are downstairs. So Delta did send me this uh, Delta Children Classic Deluxe Wood Bassinet. Uh, they send it to me for review purposes. So I basically have to do like a TikTok um, video about it. I have to do like an Instagram post a review on what's it called Walmart. And a few other places where you could leave a review. So yeah, I can't wait to open it. I was supposed to open it this this week, but then this happened. I don't want to show this face, burnt face, burnt body on um, camera. So I'll see how I'll do it. I think I'll do it tomorrow. But yeah, you see, it's really, it's my forehead is darker. You can see it right there. And then I was putting on my moisturizer and it was burning all right so we're putting away Jaylene's clothes right here putting away her little pants i'm trying to keep myself organized with Jaylene and the kids clothes so anyways go wipe your mouth because you have chocolate all over your mouth they were eating ice cream upstairs in the carpet wait to give your mom a heart attack kids it's not funny my nose is starting to peel more my nose. My nose. been a long evening as you guys have seen i was putting away clothes i had to put away clothes that i've been washing these past days a lot of it was mine i didn't want to leave it in the baskets because then it will stay there forever and then i had to make sure my kids <laughs> she's watching a movie it's already late we're gonna go lay down already i'm talking though because my husband is already asleep but um the boys took a shower. I took Jaylene a shower. I always put her hair up, at least like right here, because she hates having her hair in her face. She hates it. One thing that I didn't mention, we did receive our hustle today, finally. Oh baby, this is so cool. I only had to pay for the shipping. It was with the T-Mobile Tuesday. If you have the company T-Mobile, Make sure you download the app because they have deals like this. Like, I only had to pay for the shipping. Um, the puzzle was free. The shipping was like $9. And besides that, I ordered pictures that I already put up right there. Um, they were all supposed to be in black and white. But only this one, they send it in black and white. So, I have to reorder that one. And then just keep these in color. <laughs> So, yeah, besides that, I mean, the quality of the pictures are pretty good. I forgot what the company was called, but I'll leave it around here somewhere. They have an app. So, from T-Mobile, you use, you download the app, and then they, you put in the code, and then you were able to get your free puzzle, but you do have to pay the shipping. That, that promotion is already over, but, you know, if you have T-Mobile, always check it out. T-Mobile Tuesday. Mm -hmm.